Hi, I'm Jill Somerset from Washington State, and today we are talking about how to diagnose peripheral arterial disease, or PAD, which is restricted blood flow in the leg arteries due to plaque buildup. If you have leg pain while walking that goes away with rest, or if you have pain in your feet at night that wakes you up and it feels better when you dangle your legs over the side of the bed, or if you get up and walk and it feels better, you might have PAD or PAD. So how does your doctor know for sure that you have this? First, your doctor may order a simple ankle brachial index test, or it's called an ABI. And a vascular technologist, just like myself, will put blood pressure cuffs on your legs and your arms. We do this so we can measure the difference between the two pressures. And we do a calculation. When you get a reading between 0.6 and 1.0, that indicates mild to moderate PAD or PAD. A reading below 0.5 is certainly more serious and a reading above 1.4 is also abnormal. And that means that the arteries cannot be compressed by the blood pressure cuff due to that hard calcium buildup in your arteries. So the ABI can also offer a false normal result if you have that heavy calcium in your arteries due to diabetes. So if you are experiencing leg pain, it's very important to ask your doctor to follow up with a leg artery ultrasound. And this is when we put some gel on the surface of your legs and use a probe to take a look inside the arteries. The sound waves from the probe are used to produce an image inside of your arteries, like taking pictures. And this will give us a more accurate picture as to where your arteries are narrowed or maybe blocked. If you get the results from your physician, you may see a preliminary assessment offered by the vascular technologist as well. A more advanced method of diagnosing advanced PAD or PAD is slowly being integrated around the world. And that's a new novel test called pedal acceleration time or PAT. Pedal means the foot. And inside the foot, there are foot vessels that can also be blocked. So I've developed this direct imaging tool using ultrasound of the pedal vessels that can give doctors more information about blood flow all the way to the toes looking at the vessels in your foot. Now, not all facilities have this advanced testing available, but if you have advanced peripheral arterial disease known as critical limb ischemia or CLI, it is worth asking your doctor if their vascular technologist can learn and apply this new technique to your ultrasound. This technique is called pedal acceleration time or PAT. I am Jill Somerset from Washington State with this week's medical notepad.